Good morning, everybody. So I had it in the press overnight. It was a bit uh, not fully dried yet. And what I did is I replaced, let me see, it's still stuck here. I replaced the uh, paper towels, I removed the paper towels and the remain entirely and put it between two plexiglass so you can see the smoothness of the leaf casting here. Very smooth, right? So once it dries out, and we'll wait on this, once it dries out fully, what I'm going to do is uh, uh, go ahead and uh, measure the thickness of this pulp and thickness of the wrap. Uh, and I might also do some other measurements, so we'll see. But it looks pretty good right now. It's holding pretty well. As far as thickness go. Point oh nine is the pulp, the infill. Point eleven. Point thirteen. Point oh seven. So it depends where you're doing it, but on average it's about point one or so. And let's measure around it here without causing damage to the cover. Point oh seven. Point oh seven. Point ten. So it's close, right? It's very close. Around here is what? Point oh eight. So I've been doing leaf casting for a while now and my pulp is always thick and always have a hard time folding it and used uh, chemicals, I think like, like that to make it pliable and foldable and techniques and all that. And this is just foldable. Look at that. It folds and it, it goes with the rest of the cover. See that? It's natural looking too. It's just like not too bad. Uh, what's the weight? Let's look at the weight. Did it gain weight? Did it lose weight? I would say probably gained a little bit, right? Oops. Six point eight one. So it was six point eight. Six point eight and before it was six point eight eight, it means it lost a tenth of a gram. Not eight tenth of a gram, but uh, eight one hundredth of a gram. Zero point zero eight gram, right? Even though we added pulp, zero point zero three. So it lost technically uh, nine one to about uh, about 0 0.1 gram it lost. Where, where that 0 0.1 gram was, it probably was acid and grime and soiling that washed out. Then I dried this. So experiment wise, it is a success. We do have a match as far as the width of the pulp goes. It looks natural, it feels natural. And I'm gonna do the same for here. I'm gonna use a different kind of pulp here. Nice thing about these, and they're all the same. Like if you do a couple of them, I'm gonna do the grammage on a couple of them and see what they turn out to be. And uh, based on that, I'm gonna use the same amount of pulp on all of the wraps. And hopefully, when we end up folding it at the end, it's not going to be thick at, at the bottom versus the top. It's going to be even between the bottom and the top. So it looks, it'll look natural, right? Very nice. So I put it in the heat press overnight. And it's early in the morning before work. And I'm going to head out soon. I just want to take a look at it and see how it looks when it's nice and flat. Because I... 
played with the cover way too much yesterday and and I'm interested in also knowing if the heat press if the heating is going to remove some of the uh, water from the cover and mix it uh, see it's very nice I, I really like it thin in some spots and I think that's where you could add some more on your own without really paying attention to the grammage, right? You could just like add a little bit here, add a little bit there, right? A little bit thin. Um, but does it look good or what overall? I think it looks great. I think folding it. Look at this. Folds beautifully. Weight wise, let's see if it gained weight or lost weight. We were at uh, 6.81 yesterday. What are we at now? We are at 6.75. Yeah, we lost uh, another six tenth of a gram. And that's the water weight because heat, uh, the heat press is gonna evaporate some of that water. So yeah, so the weight, <coughs> weight of the cover is gonna fluctuate, right? It was a, at the high of 6.88 before I started. Yesterday it was 6.81, today it is 6.77. Fluctuating depending what I do with the book, right? Um, now that I heat pressed it, you know, the water has clearly um, gone out of the way. Um, as far as hydrogen bonding, tremendous. I didn't talk about that. Really good hydrogen bonding. Um, so it's pretty good match, in my opinion. All right, um, what's the tolerable difference? I would say give or take zero point oh five to oh eight. So it's twice as thick is okay, in my opinion. 0 0.9 here so if you go 0 0.9 as it is in this thick area and I think this thick area matches better with the rest of the wrap I think this is the way to go on the other wraps and the other wraps I did do already some statistics on them I'm gonna do the splash page the center fold and there's a a wrap with the ads all the ads these three i'll do an average of them and that will give me the amount of pulp i need to fill in these triangular losses